it's an upset that will go down in college football history. Old Dominion beat Virginia Tech 49-35 Saturday night in front of the biggest crowd ever at SB Ballard Stadium. And after the game, students charged the field in celebration, and the celebration didn't end there. And your size, Marlena Belores is live now with how some rowdy fans got out of hand. Well, Tom, the students were fired up so much so that they set a few couches and chairs on fire. We spoke with students who live on the street where it happened, and they say Saturday night is a night they will not forget anytime soon. A historic, unexpected win. Awesome, crazy. 1.8% chance. Old Dominion defeats 13th ranked Virginia Tech. Something like that, especially, really brings the community together. Celebrations immediately started on the field and soon after on nearby streets. 42nd Street was completely sworn with students. It didn't take long for things to heat up. Couches burning all down 42nd Street. It was crazy. Um, Fires all over, police shut down the whole street. Video posted to Twitter shows the fires. Five or six, maybe seven, I don't know. It was all down the street, all over the place. And the large crowd that filled the streets. There was probably six or seven hundred people. Just One couch was set on fire outside of Alec Emanuel's house while he was asleep. Uh, I woke up the next morning and it was still like charred, like over on the side, like smoking a little bit. He and his roommates don't know who is responsible, but they're not too upset about it. Yeah, we actually had it right here uh, in front by our garbage cans because we were just getting rid of it. For them, the memories are worth it. You know, it's it's fun to kind of move into that same like tailgating and celebrating kind of thing that those big schools do. Even though it does bring some repercussions, I think it's still a lot of fun. We know that Norfolk Police, ODU Police, and the Norfolk Fire Department were all on scene Saturday night. Norfolk Police say they did not make any arrests. We know one person was arrested for arson. That showed up in ODU's crime log this morning. We reached out to the university for more details, and we have yet to hear back. For now, live in Norfolk, I'm Maria Lana Valores, 10 on your side.